Let's take a look at another factoring problem. This particular problem doesn't follow any specific pattern, like difference of squares or perfect square trinomial. So we just need to recognize that we're going to factor this with two sets of parentheses. And we need to ask ourselves first, what are the factors of 10? The factors of 10 are 1 and 10, and 2 and 5. So we're either going to have a 1x and a 10x, or a 2x and a 5x. Um, because our middle term here is, is 17, um, and we're going to have to multiply by 3, I'm thinking maybe 5 and times 3 might work. Let's try this. Uh, 2x here and 5x here. And then I'm going to multiply, let's see, factors of 3 are 3 and 1. We'll put a 3 here and a 1 here. So let's just check what we have so far. This middle term here would be 15x, and this product would be 2x, and I need to get to a negative 17x. And if you notice, 15x and 2x adds to 17x. However, notice the negative sign here. Right? I need to make sure that, that, that we have a negative 17x. So if this was a minus here, and this was a minus, that would be perfect, because then we'd have negative 15x and negative 2x, which would sum to negative 17x. And notice this will work because a negative 3 times a negative 1 would give us a positive 3. So the correct factoring for this trinomial is the quantity of 2x minus 3 times the quantity of 5x minus 1.